It all comes down to this. Game one of possibly two games. Could be the only one. We'll see. We have made it to the preseason tournament finals. We have the Alkaline Energizers taking on the Gunslingers. I am the measuring stick, Mike Petrosic, once again on commentary. Odyssey Extreme is going to kick off. Slingers are going to start with the ball. Here's Connors. He's been excellent on return duty this tournament. Gets up to the 25 is John Wayne and the crew. Ready to start. The Duke drops back, fakes the handoff, rolls out right. He's going to try for RNS, but misses a mark. Throws it out of bounds. Maybe he was feeling the pressure. Maybe he's hung over. Who knows? Another rollout, another fake, another throw out of bounds. Uncharacteristic for John Wayne. Something must be up. He's going to drop back. No rolling out this time. He's got a couple options. He's trying to find Clint Eastwood. Dirty Harry himself. He gets a jump and grab. The defender misses. I don't think he's going to catch him. 10-5 touchdown, Gunslingers. After two unsuccessful pass attempts, that time John Wayne finds Eastwood. Dirty Harry had to do a little jumping, but he got the job done. And the Gunslingers are up 7-0. Yep, 7-0. Maybe I spoke too soon, but he doinks it off the upright. Slim Pickens is going to kick. Magnum P.I. going to return. He takes it at the 6, up to the 15, makes his way past the 20 to the 24-yard line. Pushing through. Decent return for Magnum. Buster Mack is sacked by Robert Mitchum. Didn't have time for the play to develop. That gunslinger front three just pushing their way through. Pitch to Max. He's tackled in the backfield for yet another loss. It is now third and 21. Long way to go for the Energizers. Called play. They're not going to go anywhere. Robert Duvall gets a sack. That's a quick three and out for the Energizers. They might be in over their heads. Who knows? Hunting out of their own end zone is Oxide. He gets rid of it just in time. Connors going to have a short field to work with from the 35. They get him at the 47-yard line. Slingers looking to go up two scores here. If they do, that'll go a long way with these shortened quarters. Energizers are going to have a huge hole to climb out of if they can't get a stop here. Three yards on that run. Wayne dropping back. He's looking. He's got someone short. He's going to try long for Arnest, though. Defender was there, but Arnest catches it. Big gain. First and goal from the two. Gunslingers can just punch it in here. They're going to pitch out to Ford. Ford is wrapped up, though. He ends up losing four yards. It's now second and six. Roll out. He's got someone in the back. He's got a couple options. He finds Eastwood. Touchdown. He's got him in the corner. Yet again, John Wayne to Clint Eastwood for a touchdown. And the Gunslingers are going to go up two scores early. We aren't even out of the first quarter yet. Energizer's defense non-existent, unable to stop the pass. Here's Pickens. Very strong kick. This one might go into the end zone. Sure enough, Magnum going to take it out of his end zone. He bounces off a couple guys, gets up to the 15, cuts down. He's got a lot of room. Breaking more tackles down at the 30. That was almost a 35-yard return if you can consider where he took it out of the end zone. Pro Cell, Flea Flicker, Mac looking for Power Cell. Does he have him? He does. Hits him in stride. The defender missed. Got one guy to beat. 10-5 touchdown. Energizers are back in it. A quick score. K Power Cell with the catch on the flea flicker. Buster Mack putting it on point. That pass was dipped in honey and on the money. And we're going to go into the uh, second quarter here. 14 7. Slingers up, but Energizer's not out of it yet. If they can get a turnover, if they can have a successful defensive stand, get the ball back, they can be right back in it before half. Here's Connors. Takes it up past the 20. Quickly tackled at the 23-yard line. John Wayne reading the defense, looking, trying to find a hole. He throws. Ooh, it's blocked. Defender was right there, incomplete. And then they <laughs> tackle Wayne just for good measure. Wayne shotgun, direct snap to Ford. He doesn't get very far. Just past the original line of scrimmage, third and nine. 
Wayne looking again. Defender in his face. He throws. Defenders there. Caught by Eastwood. Coverage be damned. He hauls it in for the first down. Wayne to Eastwood has been the uh, key to success so far for the Slingers in this game. Hell, pretty much the tourney. I know he likes to chuck it up to Arness, but I think a lot of their points come from uh, throwing to Eastwood. Wayne's got all day. Gets rid of it just before the sack. Completes it yet again to Eastwood. Eastwood moving through traffic. Gang of tacklers take him down. He does hang on to the ball. Minute 34 left in the first half. Flea flicker. He's got an option short. He does to Cooper. Gary Cooper gets the first down. He's going to get the touchdown. Slingers are going to go back up. 14. If they can make the extra point, it'll be 21 to 7. Commanding lead with halftime looming. Pickens, kick, doinks it off the upright, it's through, 21-7. Energizer's defense just can't get a stop to save their lives. Let's see if they can keep the offense going. They were successful in that flea flicker play earlier, but that was one play. The drive before that, they were quick four and out. Mack fakes the handoff, rolls out left, steps up, throws, throws into coverage, incomplete. That's not going to do it. 51 seconds left in the first half. Mack, shotgun. Called play, pitches to Max. That goes for a big loss. They take their first time out. Third and 16. Let's see what Mack does. Roll out. No, flea flicker. He's got someone open at the bottom. He's got power cell. Oh, misses the mark, though. He's wide open, and he overthrows him. They're going to have to punt. Hopefully they can just hold the gunslingers till halftime, prevent them from scoring any further. Energizers will get the ball the second half, so there's your silver lining. I really think Mac would have liked that play back, put a little more touch on it, could have hit him in stride. Look at Connors go past midfield. Gets all the way to the 39-yard line. Gunslinger, they're going to just go for the field goal right away. They've got their timeouts. They have time to move the ball a little, but here's Pickens with the kick. It's not blocked. Is he going to doink it off the right upright? No, it goes straight through. Three more points for the Gunslingers, up 17 now. I don't see how the Energizers can come back from this. Even starting the second half of the ball, there's just not enough time. These shortened quarters can be a killer when you get down like this. Fake handoff, rolling out, stepping up. Mack, he's got select. Hits him in stride. Out of time, though. He's got three guys to beat. One, two, three. Holy shit. 10-5. Touchdown, Energizers. What a play before the half. Stinger select. Just had enough speed to make those divers miss. Three in succession. One, two, three. And now we're looking at a 10-point game. If this extra point can go through, no block. No doink. It's good. We go to half. Gunslingers up 24-14 over the Energizers, but now that quick score plus the Energizers getting the ball. We might have ourselves a hell of a game here. It was looking to be a blowout, but Energizers offense not giving up. It's the defense that's the problem. Here's Pickens. Short kick. Let's see what Magnum can do with the return. Blockers are there. He breaks a tackle. He's weaving through. Oh, got to the 40. Couldn't quite split those two defenders. He would have had a whole lot of daylight in front of him. Pitch out to Max. Goes nowhere. Loses six. Ugly play. Just stick to throwing the ball. It's what you do best. Nope. Again, they're going to try the same play. Max only gains a couple. Still third and long. 14 yards is the first down marker. Flea flicker, the running back's on his ass. He's going to try for power cell instead. Way overthrows him. Defender was right there, but he couldn't catch it. And a wasted drive for the Energizers. They're going to have to punt. They had a chance to really close the gap, keep it within a field goal. But now Connors is going to take over. The Slingers are going to take over, and their offense has just been nigh unstoppable. John Wayne, ready to go. He drops back. Called play, they get him. The Duke gets sacked by Nickel Cadmium. Loss of seven on that sack. No, second 17. 
Slingers inside their own 10, another sack. Back to back for Nickel Cadmium. There's a threat of a safety looming. It's third and 25 now. They are on the one. Wayne taking the snap out of the end zone. Ooh, just barely got out of the end zone before uh, getting tackled for the safety. There's the defensive stand the Energizers have been looking for. It really would have been even sweeter if the uh, offense had done something on the previous drive, but they're gonna start with great field position, already in Gunslinger's territory. To the 30, 25, 20, look at Magnum go, 10, all the way to the seven yard line. First and goal from the seven, just like that. Things are starting to look up, or start to be looking up for the Energizers. Flea Flicker, he's got the running back, Max, walks it in, untouched, touchdown, and just like that, Energizers back in it, looking to be down by a field goal. If they can get a couple more defensive stands like the previous one, they might steal this. Gunslinger's got to be getting nervous now on the sideline. You can see the coach pacing around. He doesn't know what happened. It's like they were hit with a couple surprise haymakers. They don't know where they are. And they're close to uh, blowing the huge lead that they worked uh, to build in the first half. Connors breaks a tackle, tackled at the 29-yard line. Gunslinger's offense takes over. John Wayne trying to keep his composure. Rolls out. He's looking. Is he going to go to Cooper? He does. Checks down to Cooper. Good for the first down and a lot more. Tackled at the 45. 53 seconds left in the third quarter. John Wayne shotgun. Direct snap to Ford. Ford's going to run it right up the gut. Gains five. Efficiently moving the ball. Wayne dropping back. He's got someone at the bottom. He's got Arness. He's going to connect with them. They're not going to get him. 10, 5, touchdown, Gunslingers. They're going to make it another 10-point lead. Just when things are starting to look up for the Energizers, the Gunslingers are ready to rain on their parade. Oh, but they blocked the extra point. That could be huge. This could end up being a one-point game if the Energizers can get a touchdown and a field goal. They might end up winning this 31-21. I'm sorry, 31-30, excuse me. I'm looking at the numbers, I'm confusing myself. Mac behind center. Hands the ball off to Max. He only gains one. Rolling out, he's got someone open at the top. Steps up, he's got select. Diving grab, gets up, dusts himself off, keeps running. If he'd gotten him in stride, that would have been an easy walk in six. But still, if they complete the pass, they are in the red zone in scoring position. Max breaks a tackle. Touchdown, Energizer. Excellent run by Max. Energizer Max for the quick six. And it now could be a two-point game. That blocked extra point. That might come back to haunt them. This one is good, 30 to 28, Gunslinger's still up. Energizer's fighting back. They're gonna go for the onside kick. Oh, they're not gonna recover though, it was close. A little bit more speed than they might have had it. So now the Slingers have it with the shortened field. Flea Flicker, Eastwood. Throws into double coverage, picked off by the Energizers. And they've got the ball back at the 31. 2.15 to go. I believe they have all their timeouts. They just need a field goal. Called play, sack, Robert Duvall, his second of the day. Couldn't come at a better time. Loss of eight. Energizers take their first timeout. Mack up the middle to Max. Or hands it off to Max, who takes it up the middle. Doesn't really go anywhere. Takes their second timeout. Rolling out. Oh, he had him, but he rushed the play. Throws it out of bounds. They got to go for it here. Fourth and 16. This could be the game. Mack rolls out again. He's got him wide open again. Throws it for select. Oh, he had to come back. Double coverage. Incomplete. Turnover on downs. I think the Gunslingers are going to squeak by here with a minute 25 to go and a two-point lead. John Wayne to Arnes, touchdown. There is your dagger. We're going to be looking at a second game here. Energizers are so close to completing the comeback. 
and claiming their first preseason crown, but it's not meant to be, not today. 37, 28 slingers, minute 10 to go. Magnum takes it at the five. I just, not enough time. I don't think they're gonna be able to score quick enough and get the onside and get into field goal territory, but we'll see, you never know. Never say never, Goonies never say die. Completes the max, good for the first down, but the time continues to expire. They take their last time out, 50 seconds to go. Too little, too late in my opinion. Called play, Mac gets sacked by Paul Newman, Newman's own. Mac again, fake handoff, dropping back, throwing it, throwing it a coverage, incomplete. Third and 18. Handoff up the middle to Max. That's questionable play calling. They only gained three. Fourth and 15. This is the game right here. Another handoff. They've just kind of given up. They turned the ball back over on downs. John Wayne could take a knee. They're going to direct snap to Ford, and that's going to run out the clock. And the Gunslingers force the final, final game as they win 37 28. A lot of back and forth action. Hopefully the next game lives up to this hype. We'll see. We'll talk to you then. Later.